Hey, what's up, guys? Camper Russia here. Welcome back, everybody, to another Fortnite video. Today, we have all of the changes that are coming here with the brand new 8.10, 8.1 update. Uh, it's currently 3 a.m. in the morning for me, so if I sound a little bit tired, I am. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe right now, touch that like button, support a creator code, the Camp and Rusher, and uh, send me a tweet, send me a comment if you do. Okay, this is a huge one, man. There's so much going down. Let's get right into it. First off is uh, is the baller. We knew this was coming. There it is for you. And, of course, I haven't played with it yet because the patch notes have just went live. So the update hasn't actually dropped. Very excited to try this thing out. Vending machines. This is another huge change. These convenient machines now dispense things free of charge but only provide one item slash weapon before disappearing. Uh, so th there's a couple more changes on top of that. And that is remove the material cost, which we discussed. Each vending machine will be destroyed. Common and uncommon vending machines have now been removed. And then they've also removed the mounted turret from the legendary vending machines. So this is different, man. And um, I don't think it's 100% spawn rates that that wasn't mentioned here even though i think that would be okay as well uh but this change comes with the mat change that we had a few weeks back right where we now get a, a lot more 40 percent harvest rate for example in that duo gauntlet test cup or whatever it was last week uh, or a few days back uh nate and i would punch we'd land somewhere and if we had a good vending machine you just sit there and you farm until you get that good item so uh and, and vending machines were almost too powerful and, and that's i think that's where this change come from uh comes from and i i, I don't know i'm okay with it this is a, a different change and if you get lucky you get it for free it goes away just keeps it fresh next up here the infantry rifle uh no it's not vaulted uh but the common rarity has been removed so you'll no longer see a gray one show up and honestly it's not even the worst way i don't like the weapon but i know i just don't have the best aim some people who do have uh, very good aim can can find success with this but uh i yeah we're just gonna see less of them early game not my favorite weapon I'm happy about this one. This next one is a huge nerf, and that is on the heavy assault rifle, the AK-47. Adjusted the rarity from rare epic legendary to common uncommon rare. Base damage scaling is now 36, 38, 40. So this is a huge nerf, <laughs> like I said. Uh, previously, I believe it was 40, 42, 44. Correct me if I'm wrong, it might be 42, 44, 46. Um, so they have made it now gray, green, blue. And on top of that, these things do a lot less damage. And I get it. I, I mean, I, I take the blue AK over a gold scar. Like, it's it, it, it was very powerful. However, I, yeah, I didn't see a problem with it. But again, Fortnite is, they're trying to keep it fresh. They're doing different things. I've used the word fresh a lot. I know. Uh, what do you think of this change? Let me know in the comments section. I, I, I mean, I'm not going to be angry at it. But uh, AK was probably my favorite gun it, it, you know top three gun uh it just works so well uh of course it was powerful right it, of course it was better than the the, the ar because it just rewards good aim and uh i don't know i'm interested to see what uh you guys the community is gonna gonna think about this one clingers reduce max stack size from 10 to 6 i think that's a great change and reduce the availability of tra treasure maps from floor loot chest loot uh accordingly so just just like they always do once an item is out for about a week they decrease how much it spawns uh so it kind of fits into the rotation normally next up here gameplay uh, Battle Royale crossplay matchmaking. They've combined both Xbox One and PS4 into a pool and combined mobile and Switch. So you actually have to uh, opt in to crossplay uh, because if you opt out, you are restricted to creative mode and playground. So kind of an in, uh, interesting change there. This one's funny though. Reduce the infinite dab duration from 12 hours to 11 hours in the front end. Just kidding. <laughs> Increased it from 12 to 13. So they've been doing this one, adding an hour every update is basically what's been going on. And I read that at first, but no, what? Why are they doing that? And then they dropped the just kidding on. I thought that was hilarious. Another big change. Elimination credit is now awarded to the last damager in cases of logging out. Self elim and elims due to storm damage. Uh, threshold timer is 15 seconds. Another awesome change. There's just a, a lot of decent changes in this one. And to add to it, 
A lot of you are going to be fired up about this one. Added custom consume animations for the following items. And basically all the heals. Bandies, medis, small shield, big pot, slurps, and chugs. So not only did we finally get a custom animation for the chug jug, uh, we got it for all the different uh, heals, right? Uh, consumables. So excited to, again. I haven't seen them at this point. They're here. I can't wait to try them out myself. And uh, again, not even the create, not even the biggest changes this update. Uh, obviously, the nerfs and things like that. But some of these gameplay, they're just kind of quality of life improvements. I don't know how to say. It. I just uh, not really game changing, but just really nice and rewarding for us players. I don't know if you agree, but on top of this here, the LTM is the getaway. Getaway LTM is back. First time it's been back, I think, since it actually was initially released. For audio, here are the four changes. The one I will talk about is added new audio for balloons while in the air. So I'm hopefully, hopefully this is uh, louder than what we've got because... Uh, I mean, you've seen, if you're a viewer of the channel, I get, uh, I get clapped once in a while by those, uh, by those balloons. Cause you just, you, you know, you, you can't predict it. Sometimes you don't hear it coming. Uh, I had one earlier today. I, I can vividly remember me just <laughs> getting annihilated by this guy. Cause it was a surprise attack. Uh, so I'm a fan of this, uh, an, uh, a better audio cue for balloons. Hopefully it's better. I haven't actually heard it. Tons of changes to the marker system. Uh, I'm not going to read through every single one, but one of the big ones is you can now mark via vehicles and found consumables such as apples. So just more ways to mark, especially for people who aren't in a call with their teammates in, in the duo fill, squad fill game modes. Uh, it, this mar new marking system is so much better than before. And, uh, and yeah, you're seeing all the changes in front of you. So I'm happy about that. Okay, that's most of it, uh, but of course we have the events, and and I love. There's a lot of really good info here for the event section. Uh, the Gauntlet solo test and duo event uh, has been extended. It will now run 24 hours a day, and it concludes on March 19th at 12 a.m. Eastern. All right. Matchmaking, these are the changes from the previous tournament. And the gauntlet is, uh, you are you might be seeing, I think you're seeing normal pub, uh, pub uh, lobby gameplay today. But everything else the last couple days and coming up later to today as well is uh, is a session from that gauntlet duo test. I loved it. I, it's probably the most fun I've had playing this game in a long time. Fortnite's in a good spot, at least for me. I'm really enjoying it. Uh, but yeah, you, you, you see the changes there. Just matchmaking changes, so nothing really big. Updated scoring, solo. Two points will now be awarded after reaching 15th instead of 10th place. That's for the solo tourney. For duo, increase the bus fare from 2 to 3 points. Uh, it's a temporary solution for the duo event, granting too many points to players due to eliminations, causing an inflation of points over the course of the event. And uh, you now get 2 points for reaching 7th place rather than fifth place uh so so there's there's the changes i i i'm i'm a fan of that i think they're just trying to even out uh the duo and solo uh tournament and finally listen to this one the scallywag duos cup a separate event march 16th and 17th so just in a few days here 100 grand in cash prizes just casually as a test of our prize payment systems leading into the fortnite world cup We'll be holding a 100,000 duels tournament uh, on these days. The prize pool will be distributed across all server regions with official rules and details released later this week. Uh, to participate, you have to be in the top 3% global of either the solo or duo gauntless test events as of 12 a.m. Eastern on March 16th. Uh, round one is all eligible players. And then from there, it's the top 3,000 uh, who move on to round two. So this is going to be a fun one, man. I mean, we're going to try. I'm sure my myself and, and Woody are going to try and get in this thing. Uh, we actually, we, we did get in. We were top, I think we were top 1%, but above that, I think we had like 100-something points in, in about 17 games. So we had a really good run the, the other day. Uh, so we'll give it another chance. I mean, obviously, we're not going to take home the 100K, but I, I have fun, and I think it leads to good videos in the background. Hopefully, uh, you guys enjoy watching that gameplay.
Ladies and gentlemen, that's all the news I got for you today. That's all the changes for 8.1. Again, if you're not, subscribe to the channel right now for me. It'll make sure you stay up to date on all things Fortnite. I have another video going out uh, right after this one. So uh, check the channel, do your thing. Most likely it's already up. And then I'll have a third video uh, going up to, to or during the night. I want to say tomorrow night because I haven't went to sleep. But I guess it would be Tuesday night. There we go. <laughs> I'm tired, man. I'm cut me some slack. Thanks for being here. Touch that like button. Support a creator code, the Camp and Rusher. Uh, I'll see you in a couple hours. Take care.